San Jose going with the same group, uh, with the exception of Hernandez uh, out, Atacora in. Hernandez has a bit of a of an injury problem, a quad problem, and so some issues with being fit and ready to go. Houston has some issues about getting a little speed in the lineup, and they did. The Northern Cal third game they've played in the span of a week, John, and you wonder just how much Dominic Kinnear's team is going to have to use that bench. Well, he's made a couple, three changes in his lineup. Wando with a nice flick ahead. That is good soccer. Oh, that's a beautiful touch. Kari Stevenson all alone. Left foot strike right on. And Tally Hall makes the play. But that is a good player. Big target guy. Take a look at that one. It didn't look like it. I, would, I don't think I would have called a penalty on it. You know, and everybody in the stadium knows he wants to go to his left foot. Make him go to his right foot. He got kicked a little bit there. You know, Beta sure got him. Let's see. Beta sure got him a little bit right there, although I think they just made an awful lot out of it. And the question is, we could get Chicago and it's been kind of an odd year for him, too. They've moved him around to different spots. He's now playing that forward spot. There's a bad mistake. A giveaway. And then a chip up over the top that goes just wide. And even Kalen Carr knows he should have done better with that ball. Betasher is just hoping, just hoping he can do something to distract Carr. As Kalen Carr is at full stride, and Kalen Carr is going to be disappointed when he sees that. And Carr has been pretty active. One of the forwards for Houston. Ball kept in, and Brad Davis. Well, he waited. A nice ball. It'll be a corner for Houston. And some frustration from Corey Ash. He probably should have done better with that ball. He should have done better with that ball. Still looking for a goal and an assist this year. And he's played most of the season at fullback here. But look at Betasher. Betasher recovers and tackles that ball out of play. And the job is to just get in the way, and Betasher. Used every bit. Gets up there as a good look. And it sure was. He came all the way up to get it. Now Beta Shore on a dead sprint. A little chip to the middle. Oh, it's a beautiful goal. Kari Stevenson charging through. And he buries one in the back of the net. This, Jim, is a team game. And that is a fabulous team goal. And it happens because of the finish by Kari Stevenson. But this goal was had way back in the middle of the field. But Betasher, Stevenson, how about Betasher? He's a second-year right fullback with five assists on the season in only a dozen games or so, and that is a great finish inside the left post right past Tally Hall. Given, you know, Houston may not have scored, but it's not because of Brad Davis. He has given his mates some good opportunities. Good chance here. Davis gets taken down. Oh, gave him and that they, one. Yep, they point to the spot. And a penalty coming. Davis went down to the first half in a heap. And here to start the second half, he goes down in the penalty area. And Houston will get a chance to equalize. Coastly gets it through two, right to Davis. Davis is right there. Burling trips him. And there's your PK. game is tied. On the goal by Davis on the PK. Fourth goal of the season. That's odd. It seemed that that foot was bothering him about a minute ago when he was laying down to the ground. And well, he drove this one. It was a right guess by Bush. Just too well struck by Davis. That is a good PK by Brad Davis. Dawkins. He can be dangerous. He stepped up on Hano and a drive Cronin. Yeah, Sam's not gonna like that one very much. Way too much under it. Good effort by the Quakes to keep possession of the ball. Weaver pulls that one down. Miscommunication and Stevenson off and running. Does he get a good bounce? Yes, strikes one. 
So a turnover by Houston leads to a great chance by Stevenson. Well, he has a goal in this match, and he has San Jose's only goal, but he's had two really good chances as well. Here's a mistake. Cameron tries to cover up for it, and Stevenson has to strike it right there. He knows Cameron's right behind him. Chicago helping their causes with wins on Saturday. That's three out of four for the fire. The two scores for Philadelphia. Simon Dawkins, shot block at Tally Hall, a nice save. New York puts one on the board against Dallas. Rogers scored in that one. Maybe second on SJ Ball ahead. Bruin is there to bring it down and strike it for a goal, the second of the match. Houston, this is a late breaking team and they've done it again. Two kid out of St. Louis, big striker, had injury problems earlier. He gets the ball and he knocks it away from Bush, knock it away from where the goalie is going, and the goalie was going one way. The ball gets to him and Bruin shows he knows how to finish it. And here in the 79th minute. Quakes were up one nothing at the half, but